Yo, what's up, peoples? It's your boy, MM2K, back again with another episode of The Morning Tonic. This is where we talk about the latest and greatest in stadium news, community, and opinion. It's been a long time, well, a couple days, but it feels like a long time to me. That's how much content I put out. I didn't even realize it, but it feels like I haven't been on the mic for weeks. Uh, but it's only been a couple days because uh, we we closed on our house. I want to thank everybody and their warm wishes and all that other good stuff for congratulating us for doing that. Um, just getting some things together, final um, loose ends, getting ready, you know what I'm saying, and, and fi- finalizing our pack up and, and getting ready to move and get the heck out of here. So we, we appreciate everybody, um, you know what I'm saying, and their um, – and their support. Um, with that being said, I just want to give a special shout out to the stadium community. Y'all keep doing y'all thing, man. I'm loving to see it on Twitter. Uh, Twitter has been great as far as stadia activity on it, especially um, this week. Uh, I'm loving the positivity. I'm loving the enthusiasm. I'm loving the sensible and respectful debate that's on there as as we have as gamers all that stuff all all this week has shown you know what is great about the stadium community there's been a couple things one there's um the homie john scar had put out i can't remember the game um but he had recommended that the developer bring a certain good looking type of game to stadia they said well where's the stadium community at you know what i'm saying and the stadium community came out in in a large mass and said yo yeah, we want this game on there, and it, and, and it took and it take it took the the developer back, and even the developer for um, the Falconer came out there and said, "Yeah, bro, this is a group that's passionate about this platform. Like you, you gonna want to bring this thing over here." So that was great to see. Um, but also, what we see uh, this week is this fantastic post by the Stadia people themselves. It says, mention your favorite Stadia content creator and it replies and see if they respond. And you could just look at this thing, man. Look at how much this is scrolling. Um, of course, it's going to show you my responses first, but it's way bigger than me. It ain't got nothing to do with me. Like, there's so many people involved in this and making responses. Look at that. My, 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 uh, Twitter uh, thread or feed is, is, is slowing down. It's got to load up. So, yeah, the reason why I'm showing you this is look for this and send out your response to your favorite content creator. Why is that important? Because we want to show that despite the changing faces and despite the times that go through, we want to give out the the correct the correct information and appearance that the stadia community is growing. And we also want to send out a message to the, uh, those that are interested in creating content. I'm talking to a lot of people behind the scenes. We got some good things coming, but for those that are interested in, in content creation who may just need a little nudge or whatever, um, this lets them know that, Hey, they're going to be in great company. So definitely go out here, let people know who your favorite content creators are, and let the community know that, yes, we are creating content, we're creating more content, there's more of us out there in support of this platform, and and let them know, let them know, you might inspire someone, you might inspire a better Stadia dosage channel, you know, the, the, the Stadia boom bang channel that, that'll destroy Stadia dosage and fact finding and all. You know what I'm saying? You might inspire the next, next content creator. And that's what we're all about is inspiring people to be their best and do their best um, and, and give them the support that they need. So great stuff to see. I, again, I love what I'm seeing from the stadia community out on social media. This is what I love. Hope, I hope it keeps going. (laughs) You know what I'm saying? Um, so let's keep it rolling. And I want to thank you guys all for your support. 
uh, you know, for the stuff that we got going on personally. And lastly, I do want to let people know that if you're interested in hearing um, PNTS Network, which is affiliated to Stadia Dosage, it's our parent company. If you're um, interested in hearing PNTS Network content from a global scale across all game platforms, join us tonight, um, 8 p.m. Eastern Standard Time. Yes, the Commission podcast is coming back. And for my cloud gamers, you're going to want to hear this because there's going to be a vigorous debate between myself and my good brother Project Storm about this new GFN tier that's coming, that's already rolling out. You don't want to miss it. So with that said, I want to thank everybody for all your support. Again, we're still around. We're just getting some things taken care of. We will be back at full capacity soon. And until next time, until tonight, 8 p.m. Eastern Standard Time on the Commission, have a wonderful gaming day. Peace.